Yes, yes, welcome back everyone. It's Alim from the Soul Supplier team and I just want to say Happy New Year. Hopefully 2022 is nothing like 2020 and will be a sick year for us all. For this episode, you may notice that we're outside. The reason being is because we're unboxing the New Balance X Basement 2002 upcoming collab. As you might know, the basement is hella active out here, which is why we're outside, because we're out here. We're out here too. The basement have come such a long way from their Facebook group to what they are now, from collabs with Nike, pop-ups, parties. What they've been able to achieve is so sick. So big up Paolo and the team. We also got to meet them. So hit that I button that should pop up right about now. Well, it might be the left, it might be the right. <laughs> <laughs> and you can check out the full episode where we actually attended one of their events. So make sure you give that a watch. Let's just talk about New Balance for a second here, right? 2021, they had the protection pack, they had the paper boys, they had bear drops, man, that were really sick, really covered. The Amy Leon Dior, I don't know how to pronounce it, so don't come for me. <laughs> don't come for me. But yeah, that was a very sick collab. Um, what other drops were there, John? Bait collab. The paper boys, like it was really, they had a really sick year. So I really think everyone kind of is waiting to see what 2022 will present for New Balance. I think they're going to be on a sick run. I think the 550s is a model that people are starting to get introduced to and start to become an everyday rotation for people. So I'm, I reckon with this basement drop coming in, 2022 is the year of the New Balance. All right, so let's get into this unboxing. So this collaboration comes in two colorways, a gray one and an olive green. They both have contrasting shades, so it really complements the silhouette really well. So the New Balance 2002R usually comes in a mesh base, but for this collaboration, they've gone for a suede and new butt material. So it's a really soft and it's really sick. This pair is honestly made for the streets. The mud guard and the toe box is quite beefy and rugged. So if you're out here every day, this is a sick pair to pick up. A feature also worth mentioning is the New Balance N logo. So here it's partially stitched on, and I think this is like a recognition to the previous collab they had with Nike on the Air Max 90, London version, where it was also partially stitched. So when I first saw these pairs online, I think Paolo posted a picture on it on his Instagram. I saw the grey one and I was like, that's sick. Oh wait, no, he posted a green one on his Instagram. I'm chatting. He posted the green one on his Instagram and I was quite unsure. Then I saw the grey one and I was like, that's the one I need. But seeing it in person now, the green one really pops, man. Like, just take a look at it. Like, it pops really well. I know cameraman John agrees with me, but he's not mic'd up, so he can't hear it right now. But he's definitely agreeing that this one actually grows on you. But obviously, you'll probably get more wears out of the grey one. Also, let's mention the basement brand on there, because it's quite subtle, but it's really sick. So you have the BSMNT logo on the tongue and the basement written on the heel tab. And a cool feature underneath the lace, instead of NB, we actually have B, which is obviously is an ode to basement. So that's a really cool touch. And you have BSMNT written in the insole too. And lastly, it comes with two spare laces, one with 3M detailing. And also, each of the aglets come with the basement written on it as well. Really cool. All right, so let me talk comfort levels for a second. This is actually my first New Balance pickup. So I was really excited to try these on. And I must say, the comfort levels are up there. So it comes with this technology called Absorb. And I must say, it does give like an ultra cushion kind of feel. So if you're going to be rocking these every day, or if you're on the roads, on the streets, doing legal things I must say, then this is a pair for you. So if you're looking to get a pair of these, a release date is still TBA. But these did retail at JD Sports, early gang, for 130 So that's the price point you're looking at. Don't forget though, to head to the Soul Supplier website, hit that release reminder to find out when you can cop. Thank you for watching everyone, I've been Alim. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe, you know the order. So shout out Basement, shout out Polo. This is a sick collab. And we outside, bruh. Ash, man, make a bear noise. I was trying to record our unboxing. So for this episode, I spat bear, boy. Last one, I got this.